the Arcturian Collective, the garden is you. Channel Mary Mohler. Greetings, amazing souls. The time has to come for each and all of you to become like this, like children again. To open your hearts to remembering the great garden of Eden and to play in God's creation the way higher dimensional souls do. Here on earth and in all of creation, you are the ones that you have been waiting for. The garden lives in you. The garden is you. There is a shift in the tone of these messages from some of you may have noticed. The guidance is coming from within this frequency brighter and within all of you and not outside you. The Arcturian frequencies in High Council of Light, the Lemurian frequencies in High Council of Light, the Galactic frequencies in High Council of Light, that all inform God's grand creation and they have streamed through this channel for many years into blogs and videos are here within you, within all of you. And the time is emerging that each of you listens to messages like this one and knows that God is not outside of you. God is within you. Arcturian frequencies, Pleiadian frequencies, Mother Earth frequencies, Lemurian frequencies, Atlantean frequencies, and more of these God, Source, Creator, aligned frequencies are now wanting to be known within you. So this scribe, this frequency writer, is writing and scribing and sharing as a messenger of this higher frequencies flowing through her. And they flow through you as well. So let's remember this together as we know that anything we dream, vision and seek is within each of us. And the time to take the turn as a vessel to this wisdom and these gifts in you is now for you and for all of us. So let's take a deep divine conscious breath in and breathe divine prana and pure divine white light into the quantum essence of you that lives in your physical body temples, in your cells, in your energy fields, and in your consciousness. Breathe in the light of souls and unify with source and source vision for your unique and sacred life force on the planet right here and right now. Breathe in a few more sacred conscious breaths and know yourself as one with God, Source, Creation in all timelines and in all highest good ways. And breathe and know God is filling you every breath, your every prayer, your every challenge and your every dream with the most perfectly matched God breaths that will bring those visions, dreams, and requests to their best fruition, to their highest potential and highest fulfillment. Quantum breeding is fulfillment. When you refuel your energy fields, when you cleanse your body temples, when you love, nurture, and appreciate your divine union with Source in this way each day, 
You breathe divine fulfillment into your body temple and thus into your life experiences. This is a method of breathing and leaving heaven on earth. Through your conscious breathing, through your quantum and divine breathing, you breathe the Holy Spirit and God's pure light and the grace of the central sun's life force and wisdom into your heart center and thus into your divine knowingness and beingness. And in the grace of your divine knowingness and divine beingness, you are safe and supported and empowered to enter the Garden of Eden again. God's true Garden of Eden the usurpation of God's garden and the desecration of its being cleared away with greater and greater evidence of this to human vision and human consciousness every day. For those who still cannot see, more will materialize of this for them to see. For those who do see with God vision, with clear soul sight, and with unified breath in co-creation with souls, you are invited to come and play in the Garden of Eden again. Where do you not see the garden in your world? Imagine it there. Created there with God's pure life force within your divine vision and dreams. Plant your star seated luminous light into this ascending world, and this world in transition to much higher light and grace, and watch it grow. in conversations, in artwork, in inspirations, in relationships, in calls to be fully present with God more often in your days than you have in the past, in calls to be a creator in the present in your life, in everything you see, feel, know, experience and touch in ways that uplift this world in your presence in it. Fellow starseeds, conscious breathers, and divine humanities here on the planet at this time in the Earth's ascension. We will not think our way to this quantum and multidimensional new earth experience. No, we will vibrationally and soulfully breathe in, inspire it in, present it in, and play it into the great garden like we knew we would. In the beginning of this grand adventure, into the fall from grace for a time, now this is the time to return to the garden and to bring our unique star lit seeds to grow new visions of a rise in humanity ascended from 3D separation consciousness already and living and thriving in a whole new expanded reality where everyone works together to benefit the greater whole. The entire world and the whole entire cosmos. Today, I invite you to envision your star leads it. What color is it? What does it grow? 
What talents flow through your sacred seed? What light touches the earth through your unique seedling, the source imbued with unique sacred colors, soul codes, and divine gifts for these times? Can you feel this sacred star, lift seed, coming to life in you? Awakening from its long slumber, deep in the earth or hearth of your soul presence all this time, and ready for creationary exploration, inspiration, and action now. If it is a song or a tone, can you hum it? Can you feel it? Can you sound it? If it's a color that comes to you, what hue is it? Can you see it? Feel it? Breed it? If it has a childlike laughter within it, what is the sound of your unique God, spark laughter, that is here to plant extraordinary visions in God's great garden? Your laughter is a song in the garden of God, and it is essential for this new planting season that the entire earth and sentient life here are expressing, nourishing, and making ways and paths for them. Laughter, seeded soul songs to thrive. What conditioned, ingrained, and train the old 3D world population to give up consciousness breeding in order to survive here in this long dense cycle of serpent, usurpations and collusions is no longer working in the new divine sacred earth experience emerging every day in the ascension process in the ascension decade. The old tools do not work subservience and constricted breeding and living will not work in the new 5D expansive earth. New tools are required. Original divinely seated abilities and tools are required. Hence, the call and invitation now to connect with your sacred seed that is a soul song and sacred note, a divine gift, a celestial color, and an epic divine purpose now for you going and growing forward. In the garden, as you enter here more and more, listen for the call to play, to breathe, to be and to raise into your spirit's expression each day and release the conditionings of working harder, multitasking in blind, machine-like, disconnected, almost zombie-like ways, as drones in an ant or beehive. You are spectacular. You are one of a kind living light expressions of source. It's time to reclaim this is your now. It is time to commit this to this in your now. Witness increasing and quickening changes that are forever changing your world today. Observe that dismantling of the serpent's structures and the birthing of a new language, new light, new talents, new leadership, new inspirations, and new creations birth forth. Take a conscious breath and unify with Divine Source Creator and call in your team of guides and listen for where your soul song 
colors and codes wish to flow and empower something in your day. To make the new earth sing a little brighter and your life experiences and in directions to feel a little fuller. And the great garden of Eden to shine a whole lot brighter. Because you are simply willing to be a child of God again, playing in God's magical and miraculous garden of Eden. Yes, things in the 3D movie playing out will continue to call and invite an audience. Yet the 5D New Earth and the 5D Plus Garden of Eden is so much more colorful, engaging, powerful, inviting and soul summoning. Listen for those calls and ask for them. Feel more, think less, play more, work less. Know and remember more and trigger and fear less. Express your soul colors and uniqueness more and conform less. Be you more and shine bright more and elevate this in the world more. And before long, there has been no longer less needed. For you will have arrived in the great garden of Eden, where is all full, perfect, abundant, and filled with exponential grace. This is your destiny. This is your destination. And you can play is the new higher realms as often as you give your human self and your soul self permission to enter in and engage the fruits of God's perfection and abundance. It is there for all of us. Embrace it as much as you can. You are loved, dear ones. You are love. All our love.